Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to a special episode of the Frisky Whiskey. This is episode number 60. 60? Whoa. Oh. And the Frisky Whiskey. And of course, we got Steve. One of our regular guests on the show. Who is, it's his birthday episode. It's his birthday. But Not also officially Steve, today, but Steve. But also, birthday. Steve, we got me back here in the South Florida crew. Which you're back a nice weekend. And, and you're back for a couple of things here. I am. We'll talk about that on the show, too. We will. Okay, we'll bring that up, too. So, Mike D., Yo. I don't even think you know what we're doing. Steve, what are we doing? It's Steve's show. It is this Steve's his birthday show. show. So, Steve what are we has doing? brought yeah, so you guys a few me. little things. Oh, what are we doing? What I want to do for my birthday. Yeah, we, we did. I can't hear anything that you're saying, but keep going. And there was one word that came to mind, and that was hazmat. Hazmat. Oh shit, we're gonna we're gonna suffer, aren't we? What is hazmat? So tonight we're gonna learn about hazmat, and uh, I don't know. This. Have a little fun with it. Okay. I brought three things from my collection. They're okay. all hazmat. Hazmat means that it's at least 140 proof. Okay. And the reason it's called that is because that's the point at which you can't fly with it. And it's considered hazardous, right? Oh, dang. You can't even fly with it. You can't fly with it. Oof. You had a bottle of this, you went in an airplane, you could get arrested for having it in an airplane. That's right. Why? Would it blow up in like the, te- in the, in the pressure? That's what they say. Seriously? That's crazy. Well, it's, it's flammable, right? Does it work the same way going under, underwater? Have you ever tried it in, <laughs> in, in, in the summer? <laughs> can't speak to that. <laughs> so so these, these are so high of proof that literally they're just like, yeah, no, don't bring them. Yeah, that's the point where they say it's too flammable. Can't fly with it. So we have three that are over 140 proof. Yes. Two, so could you smoke a cigar near it? You could try. <laughs> I don't know All right, that. come on, come on. There's got to be like a limit where you're like, I can have a cigar around a good whiskey that's a high proof. And as long as you're not like putting your cigar in the glass and nosing it, you should be able to. You should be all right. right? Well, I'll tell you what. But we'll, we'll put it to the test later tonight. But right. but in general, a good whiskey would be 115. I mean, we're, we're hitting a level that people don't always oh. go to. Is this correct? Oh yeah. I mean, this is not normal. It's right. definitely atypical for all sure. All right. Yeah. So then, then what is the highest proof we're going to try tonight? 171. <laughs> Woo! We're getting uh, up. Boys! You know what? I'm going to run and get some Tums real quick. The Roll Aids are both. <laughs> hey, bring some back for me. Right? 171. 171. That is insane. All right. I, I w- think 136 is probably our cap Maybe that we've ever me. done. Yeah, yeah, I think I 136 is what we've done. Like, yeah. so you're talking you know, almost 40 proof higher. Yeah, so tonight, let's see if we can uh, we can enjoy it. You Should know, we've got the water. We got the limestone water. Yeah, ice. Right. I, I got, I'm using ice. I'm in. Ice. I'm in. I'm, I'm going to join you in the limestone water. And so the question for you two, is there any amount of water and or ice that can make some of these enjoyable? We'll find out. Well, wait, wait. Are you saying they're not enjoyable? I said for you two. So you enjoy Ooh, them. I do. Okay. So, so you like hot. <clears throat> not necessarily hot, but, you know, good hot. Like if it's done okay. well and... Uh, so if the flavors Keep meld flavor. well and it's kind of like a, you know, you have a, it's a high proof whiskey, but the flavors match kind of a, a good vibe. You don't mind it being hot. It's just. As you know, there's so much that goes into the notes and the experience of the. No, of the I spirit. know. Yeah. There's so many things. You know, the age, the balance. This and, is crazy. Uh, this is the fact mm. that you're willing to bring these hot of ones. Now, I should I get my fun. fire extinguisher out just in case? I, I mean, think you should. I mean, we have point. heat all the lights on. I, mean, I don't know. I this, think you should. You know. All right. So let's get the show going. Yeah. All right. Steve, what's our number one? Present. Okay. So we are going to go up and proof. Okay. So we're going from lowest to so, highest. So we're going 171 first. Now the first two are no, pretty we're close. Not, we're, no, we're not going 171 first. Is 171 is the cap? Oh, lowest to highest. You said. Yeah. Sorry. This one. That's crazy. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Starting that. Is ASW Fiddler okay. Syncopation. This guy is a straight bourbon whiskey, and <clears throat> it's made from 100% malted okay. Bloody Butcher corn. All right, so what's Bloody Butcher corn? I'll, so we're going to go into that. that. This corn was malted in Asheville, North Carolina, Yeah, and then it went to the distillery in Georgia, okay. ASWs, and that's where they aged it. Okay. 
so that's what, you know, bloody butcher. It's, it's just a type of corn, right? You know, there's like red Jimmy red corn and blue corn and, and Jimmy crack corn. And that I one care. too. Yeah, there's a lot of corn. So it's called, it's called bloody. It's called bloody butcher corn, and it's 100% there it is. malted corn in the mash bill. 100%. 100%. Corn. So I was trying to figure out, you know, what, like, is this at a. You know what's interesting? Single malt it's cool looking. What, do you, Look at this, what would you even call this? I that don't know. Cool. I like that. I like you know, that. I want to order the seeds. I want to I grow this. But it also kind of like ex- explains kind of the color, right? Because you're kind it, of. It looks red from here. Yeah. From here, it looks red. It's a, wow. it's a pretty red. So, you know, you know what's funny is, color, is yeah, sure. I saw I saw a video, and it's one of those those videos where they're, like, trying to figure out what's going on. And it's a guy, and he's just, like, blending corn. And he's blending corn. And he's blending corn. And then, like, the guy was watching. He's like, what's he doing? Why is he blending corn? And I was like, he's making fucking whiskey. Like, that's what that's what he's doing. He's, he's either making moonshine or he's making straight up whiskey like he's just making bourbon and because it was like you know a, like a backyard hooch you know you know backyard he's just hooch it's all he's doing he's just making he's making hooch like that he's making moonshine that's what he's making yeah <coughs> and he was doing he did a fantastic job he like blended sweet corn he kept adding like yeast sugars and stuff like that he's like i was like yeah no that dude's just making hooch <laughs> this is a british guy who didn't understand what's going on i'm just like that, welcome to America, man. That's what we we'll fucking do. <laughs> you want a drink? You how, make yourself some hooch. <laughs> That's what you do. <laughs> so how much did you pay for this? Let me get back to you on that. I've got it on the spreadsheet. Oh boy. Oh. Get the full spreadsheet out. So I'm curious what I'm seeing it on here. I'm just kind of, I'm just curious. Um it's really cool. Like this is it's such a deep red color. Yeah. And I love the fact that oh. all right, so I don't know if anyone can see that. I mean, I'm assuming if you're like on YouTube and you're watching the video, you can zoom in a little bit. That red on the, on the, I'm assuming that's like a, that's almost like a bass violin or something like that. Yeah. Is that the overture in this? That is right on par with the color that this is. It's, it's yeah, a, it really is. Is it, is it, is it the is overture amber. release? Does it say anything about overture? Um, I stole it away from, from Steve over here. Let me see. They have a website. So, Mike, to get back to your question, uh, I was I remember, I remember hearing about this, and I was so worried that it was going to be you know a pretty inflated price. Super happy to hear that it was actually sub one hundred. I got this for ninety bucks. Okay, so Thanks, I'm yeah. okay. Okay, that's why I'm glad I asked that question because what I'm seeing was between like seventy to like ninety nine. Okay, different places, but you know it always depends where you you know what you order online from. But so it's not chill filtered. <laughs> I can tell you that much. They don't add color. It's distilled and bottled by oh, of course it's distilled and bottled by ASW. That's, <laughs> that's your favorite distillery. <laughs> All right, that explains why it's on the list. Yes, that it explains is. why it's on your birthday list. Yeah, you know they're Georgia Hartwood. I love that one. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yep. I think that's that's actually what we discussed right, let's, last let's, time. Let's get, let's get into tasting together. here. Let's, let's get some let's get some pouring going. Well, in. Yeah, I'll let Steve. Oh, Steve, you do the honors. Splash yep. it about. So we're gonna do neat first, right? Yep. 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 We are. Holy <laughs> moly. I'll let you, you pour the. Well, I bet you their toasted one is really good. The Fiddler Toaster the Bourbon. Do you have any other other? I do. That's me. I've got their toasted and their amber. So, so is that toasted good? I think um, we've had the toasted, actually. I think we tried the it. Fiddler toasted? I like yeah. their toasted a lot, yes. I think we had their toasted, and it was exceptional. I don't remember, but yeah. Their amberana, <laughs> I will say, is not one of my favorites. Surprising. Right, here you go. But I do like. So the this one's not on their website. Yeah, I think it was kind of a pretty special release one. Yeah, that All is right. so much chocolate. I don't know if they're gonna do <laughs> it. That's like All dark right. chocolate. Holy moly! And what's the proof on this one again? This is this baby is one forty three. One forty three. You're sort of going to go slow. This I, is, I this is the lowest the one, one because they only give you the percent of the bottle. Man, uh, that does the amount of chocolate in this is insane. It's like milk chocolate. I don't know about milk chocolate, but no, it's there's... sweet. It's sweet on the nose. It's not like a dark chocolate. It's definitely chocolate. It's definitely spicy. It's a spicy yeah. milk chocolate. Yeah, for sure. Okay, all, all right. right. Steve, lead us into it. Hold go on, ahead, take the first on, step when you're ready. Hold on, hold on, I got it. But man, that smells so freaking good. Mm. That smells so good. Okay, let's dive in, guys. You know, my tongue feels I'm like waiting. it has cocoa on it. I'm waiting. So he's right about the chocolate. I'm waiting. It's not super hot. 
This is tasty. I'm definitely getting one note from this. Okay. Predominantly. So I wouldn't say it's like an what's your, overall. What's your note? What's your note? Balance. It, it's it's the same as the nose. It's that milk chocolate that carries through really nicely, but it's it's really kind of like a singular spice note behind for me. It. You know, have it's a spicy. The, um, the dropper, please. I do get the heat, but it's earthy. The spice there, makes there, it earthy. Like, I think that spice makes it earthy. The, it's a milk chocolate, but there's an earthy flavor behind it. Like it's it's pleasant though. Like it's hot. Like I can tell it's this is 140 proof. Like I can. Yeah. No, I, agree. I can tell. Yeah, you can tell. But it's like you get the milk chocolate sweetness, but then there's like an earthiness. There's like a, there's definitely like a, this is a grain alcohol. Like it's very prominent. She's right hot. There. She's hot. She's hot. Baby. And it looks like Mike's having a good experience over so here. So I did two H2O. drops and yeah. the chocolate really comes out more in the flavor okay. in your mouth. And kick it this way. Um, that's tasty with the uh, water. Mm. The smell is fantastic. So the smell is not like the taste. I, I would say like, yes, you can get the, the milk chocolate. But the milk chocolate in the flavor is more earthy. Like you can definitely tell there is corn. Like it, there is definitely corn. Mm. You know, it's got good legs too. It's like a wine. It's got really good legs. Man, that is good. Yeah. That's kind of like eating fresh corn off the cob. Like, like the the flavor. Corn. I don't know. Like, if no, no. That. The earthy. Uh, no, the earthiness of it. Is like that's what it reminds me of. Is like you boiled some corn, you take a bite of it. There's still that. The, there's a little bit of chocolate there, but it's not as prominent as the milk. Some that hints of uh, maritime. Like not even close. <laughs> maritime. Zero. Maritime notes of iodine. in there. So it's definitely there. Like and... the nose is a hundred percent milk chocolate. <laughs> it's very creamy, like that kind of stuff. Mm-hmm. But the taste. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, 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 oh. The taste, though, to me, like you can tell this is corn. It's like biting off of a corn on yeah. the cob on the flavor. So, like, it's very, it's spicy, but it's like you take. So, a this is something like I can maybe introduce to certain people. It's not overbearing. It's not, especially with water. I really, it, I'm, I'm it, liking. Uh, it. Was I right about drops. the water part? Yeah, Wait, it, the, tro- the chocolate came out more. I did two, and you did two. And, I'm, and it brought that chocolate out. I, I really enjoyed that. So now I'm, I'm going to go ahead. Okay. Because I've been having some extra heartburn lately before the show started. Mm. So, you know. Okay. One. I'll try to. One cube. <laughs> so the chocolate, maybe the earthiness that you're getting, I think is definitely attributed to the malted yeah. aspect yeah. of it. Yeah. Because to me, it's like when, when I'm tasting it, it is more, you can taste the grain. Like, and it it's almost like, just going to Publix, going to the grocery store, picking up an ear of yeah, corn. Yeah, like a fresh ear of corn. You, I get bo- that. you yeah. boil it, you cool. take a bite of it, and that's what it tastes like. But when you nose it, the nose is all creamy melt chocolate. Kind it's of a, like kind of a deep flavor on that with a little bit of spice because of the temp. You know, it, it's 143 proof. So it's like you smell the temp. But it's it's so weird having that dynamic where it's like really mellow and then hot when you smell it. <laughs> I don't think it's that. I mean, it's spicy. I'm, I don't think it's super hot. Like I said, I think no, it's hot. But for it's 140 different. proof, this is not bad. Now with the ice cube, I'm just gonna say it got creamier. Oh, but I think I liked it better with the two drops, really? in my opinion. Okay. Okay. That's I'm just doing crazy. the ice now at this point, just so this I don't have crazy. any heartburn. <laughs> <laughs> to me, it's crazy sipping on it and having it taste like corn. It's weird. I'm not expecting it. Like, I'm that's not getting the, that corn sensation you're going through. To me, it's it's. Uh, I'm just it's not different. I get the fresh ear. Yeah, definitely on the palate. It, you it, see it's, that? It's, it's right? a spicy, fresh ear of yeah. corn. Yeah, it's a fresh ear of really? corn, and it's like, like the nose. That's milk chocolate every day of the week. The flavor, even with water. Is a fresh ear of corn like you just husk it? Like you thrown it into the water, you boiled it, you just you didn't even throw butter, salt, nothing on it. You just you take a bite of it. That's what it tastes like. But it's it's spicy. I'm getting excited. <laughs> for that. I'm getting excited for the next one. So it's uh, yeah, it's different. 
I like this one a lot, though. This is, this is um, I so where did this you, to me feels like American. Where did you get this? Like, is this a is this something you can get at like Total Wine? Is it something you had to go to like the, like Inlet or one of our favorites? No, I got this one from Sealbox. Okay, and I don't even know that it made its way to the general public. I, I'm in there. Uh, whatever, so you guys in your program. VIP stuff and your secret vaults and all that, man. I'm not. Can I you just, can you send me a little sample of this? Absolutely. Just let, you don't have to send a lot, buddy. I'll send you two. I would love you forever. Why don't you just get some There's, of those things and put them in your in your uh, bag home? They're not going to know. They're going to think that's it's right. You can't fly home with this one. No, I can't. Oh, I can get it shipped. Oh to me. no, yeah. Can no? Can you ship it? You can. He can ship no. it. Well, you, it just be ground ship. Ground ship it. Yeah. 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 He can ship. Who it. ground ship? I mean, where do you find that? He just grabs little vials and strips them. Yeah. Just uh, hey, do you? Hey, you. you Go to you North Carolina. This address. UPS, take these vials. Yeah, yeah. UPS, take these vials. They can't U, be U, UPS, FedEx. <laughs> they can't be flown. UPS, FedEx, <laughs> ground shipping, all like uh, you know, not in the air. Yeah. So, <laughs> Steve, let, listen, you can't fly with this. Correct. That's right. It, it is. It, 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 it may explode in in the pressure of the air cap. No, I don't think it's a pressure thing. I think it's just that it's flammable. Yeah. yeah it's flammable. the fact that if you actually lit this on fire, it would burn. <laughs> yeah, and it would burn clear. If it wasn't so and good, I would wrong. like to experiment with something, but we're not going to do that. Yet. Unless we get really <laughs> drunk, and it'd be a great idea but for then, three but, drunk guys. And what could go honestly, wrong with high uh, <laughs> high content alcohol and matches? What could go? Wrong? So if, if I was going to say, like, as far as high proof go, like, I I oh. genuinely really like this one. Like, this is. <laughs> I, no, I, I would get a bottle. I would buy a bottle. That's what I was asking. I like. like I would this get one. this. And you said it's less than ninety nine dollars. So, <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah, no, if, I, price. if I could find this for that price range, absolutely. Yeah. Their other know. ones are online. Oh, so this I is one of those unique them. ones that you throw into your batch and you're just like, hey, you like whiskey. Let me let me introduce you to something interesting. Yeah. Like it's it's one of those ones. Oh, when I saw those a hundred percent bloody butcher core, I said, oh, yeah, that's that's pretty uh, pretty unique. And I think you agree with me. Like it tastes like corn. Like you're biting off corn when you when you drink it. It's yeah, you definitely get the corn. You definitely get the malted aspects of it. Malted, I'm cool. getting. This corn thing, I'm just not getting it. <sighs> You're missing out. I'm not getting. It. I'm missing out on life. It's a, it's a story of my life. I'm missing out <laughs> on life. Yeah. All right, so, so you guys ready to move on to the next? Yeah. So Steve, it's it's your birthday, right? So what are you, what are you doing this weekend? And you were telling me something kind of cool you're doing this I'm weekend. I'm swimming with the fishes. So is that like so a submarine thing you're doing? Like, or bad, are you offing it? yourself? Or? <laughs> yeah. What are you, are you, are you like, killing what? somebody? Because that's what you do. I mean, what are you like, doing? You piss somebody, piss you off, <laughs> and that's it. We're doing a little diving. I got a buddy nice. coming in from out of town, and okay. uh, we're going down. Going that's under. a good birthday. That's a good yeah. birthday weekend. Going down under. Going out of Jupiter, you know, square grouper. Oh, I love square grouper. First off, their food there is awesome. But oh, yeah. Also, love the atmosphere, too. Oh, there's great places They're around awesome. there. I mean, you have so many restaurants. I'll probably be there. there tomorrow, actually. And that's where they, they what, filmed the Jimmy Buffett com- yeah. uh, mm-hmm. Vid- mm-hmm. music video? Yeah. I'll actually be there tomorrow at 1 a.m. Or 1 p.m., sorry. Okay. Not 1 a.m. Yeah. yeah, you know that's what? Too early. Get, that's too early. Get, get drunk tomorrow during the day, Travis. Because tomorrow we're having a fantasy draft, and you'll you'll probably pick oh, Tom Brady every pick. Yeah, that's what I'll do. You'll get drunk, Tom Brady. Brady. <laughs> so fantasy football is going on. It is. It is. It is. I know. You, you, are you a football fan? Do you pay attention to football? I don't know. I think we talked about this, and he okay. said no. No. Okay. Not not in the submarines or anything. I'm like here that? for the support, guys. Okay. All right. So <laughs> he's part, here for the food. So and the part whiskey. of the part of the surprise <laughs> that you guys did to me today is also that Travis will be here for our draft tomorrow. <laughs> Facts. I'm smoking up a uh, some beef ribs. I can't wait for the dinosaur ribs. But you know, watching football, there's some pre- preseason games going on tonight. Yeah, 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 yeah. But this is a big draft weekend. Like I think it this is. is like I read something. It was like one of the biggest weekends in fantasy football in terms of because drafting. we only have we only have like two weeks left. Barely, before yeah. it starts. Yeah. So it's so like, why is it big? Um, or it's three weeks. It's three weeks. What, why is fantasy football big this weekend? Because this is when a lot of people are doing their drafts for their leagues. It's okay. at, it, it, like, it's I don't know if you meant this weekend is bigger than years past. Well, no, no, no. no, no. It's, okay. it's, it's closest to the actual start of the, the season. season. Yeah. So it's like now you've had the most time to see all of the players playing on the teams that like you could possibly get. So it's or like, who got hurt? You know yeah, what draft somebody yeah, got hurt. So you, now you have an idea of how good they are, how bad they are, what the team dynamics are, that kind of stuff. So yeah. now you can start picking your players. To start like and there's like building up the, the fantasy teams and and we're we're kind of like on the low end of of fantasy draft like wins so like first place gets what eleven hundred yeah. 
And then, uh, like at the end of the day, like when you think about it, it's it's a lot of money. But when you look at fantasy football in general, like we're kind of in the mid. Like we're just kind of eh. no, we're a fun league. We're a great league. But no, 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 no not no, the no. league, not the league. I'm saying like the winnings. Winnings are solid winnings. What are you talking? Those about? are great winnings. Like you they need to stop do. talking. Come on. <laughs> I'm just saying, it's, it's, eleven hundred dollars is great, but it's, it's fun. It's, like, nah. it's just a lot of people out there. Are, you there's like it. millions of drafts going on it. this weekend, like yeah. probably millions. Yeah. Like, yeah. Fantasy football is huge. So, what are the standouts this year? How is this year different from others? Uh, not not so much different. I think there's a lot of good players this year, and a lot of good. You you can build good solid teams, except for Travis Hill. And, <laughs> <laughs> You're just uh, mad because you know, last you know, year I got second. Yeah, you, third, still, you fell third, apart. Third, yeah, you fell apart again. All of my team just died. Yeah, but, but it's fun. But it's gonna be a fun draft. We have people coming over tomorrow. Is, We're gonna have beers and some, like I said, beef ribs. And Travis will pick Tom Brady multiple times by accident, <laughs> and then somehow he'll scream out "Anna Verteri" at some point too. <laughs> I don't even know what you're talking about. All right, let's bring out that. Let's bring out that second whistle. Okay. Too much. All right, time to clean your glasses. Clean your glass, Travis. It's nice doing this inside. It is. It's like, so, I, although I'm looking forward to the winter. I'm doing shows outside in the winter. I, lo- I yeah. love those. You have to wear a jacket. I love. That. Are you going to come up and? Yes, I'm going to figure that stuff. I'm getting. I'm getting my stuff together in my job now. So I, I, I start taking off like on a Thursday, probably. Okay. You know. Past the. Uh, yep. Now, whoever gets super drunk tonight has to drink that glass of water <laughs> before no, they I'm leave. Good. I'm good. Let Sorry in advance, buddy. Yeah, I'm good. Yeah. <laughs> it's like a ritual for you since you're in town. All right, so this guy, um, they've oh, got hello a double oaked product that I would have always loved to have had. Can I guess? But was never able to. Oh. No, you can't. Okay, so never able to get it. A double oak product that you've always wanted to have. Yeah, I, I like this. Just Mr. I want. So, is it a name that we would know? I think so. Yeah. Is it chicken cock? No. Sorry. Sorry. I'm not even going to guess. It looks like an Old Forester birthday bourbon it bottle. It does. Oh. Very, you know, I actually put them side by side <gasps> to see if it was the same bottle. I but no, they have subtle differences. They and it's different Old Forester. It, they, no, different it's not glasses. Old Forester. And it's not Old bring it up, Forester. Bring it up. Bring it up. Bring it up. All right. And, and the best part, not the, you know, one of the parts, is that this guy is signed by their master distiller. So that's kind of cool. Okay. All right, this is, and I got this from a raffle. You, you, dude, you in your ways, you get whiskey is insane. He's, he's the fucking what do you wizard. Do? What kind of submarines do you build? Well, I <laughs> want to know what's going on. Hey, when you put the warlock hat on, things happen, oh, all right? My gosh. Um, so this baby is 13th Colony. Oh, I love rye whiskey. Colony. I love that Cast bottle. strength. I never had 13th Colony. And she's 143.37 yeah. proof. How much? 143.37. Just oh a gosh. touch above the last one. But you know one thing about Thirteenth Colony it is a is flatter. They it are is, that's flatter. dark. Like the color is always so super dark. dark. Man, that is looks dark. Pretty though. You, you know what? That, that looks grab, so pretty. Get, get the other bottle. I can't see any light. No, no. no grab that. the other bottle, real Steve. Quick. Bring it up to the camera. And get the bring, other it up, bring it because up to the camera. Look, I mean, no, they're these not going to be able to see that. You got to bring no, it. Up. You got to do it. You're, you're in the middle. I'm in the middle. Grab the ground. No, I'm saying you have to bring it up to the camera. Like you. No, no, no. Don't worry. Bring it up. No, don't worry. No, no, no. I'm not sure what's happening right now. Don't get up. Bring it up to the camera. No, no, from from like here, and like walk up. Oh yeah, I see what you're saying. Yeah, because they need to see it up close. close up. Yeah, because yeah. Th- I mean, because like there's they're both a noticeable 140. difference, and they're there's, both one forties. There's a noticeable difference between the colors. That's crazy. So one is like, all right. So so if you show all right. the well, first wow, one we drank, I know. Granted, this one's a little bit wider, but wow, it's got more girth. <laughs> 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 so the corn one, the very first one we had, is much lighter than that 13th colony. Like this one right here. Oh, boy. You okay? This one right here. I felt like it hurt. <laughs> is so dark and so, like, bring, amber bring, color. Bring her to me. Okay. Bring her to me. Bathe her like, and bring her to that me. That is pitch black. Wow, that dark. Like, that is so I don't insane. think I've ever seen a whiskey that dark. All right, so how did you come across this one? That was another raffle. Yeah. What raffles do you go to? Where you <laughs> so actually, is it a church? It was through the same company as I got this one. All right, so how much it was, was this Sealbox one? Raffle. So w- were you there physically? Like no. A, like, like a card? No, I got an email. It's email a correct. Raffle. It's an how email raffle. How it always starts. How does that happen? Yeah. How it, it always starts. Sense. 
Is it like By the way, when when do we get picked for the uh, the old Forrester birthday bourbon? It's like this week or next week? Man, is I'm next so week? excited for this new it's one. So this week, is 11 right? and a half years old. Oh, week. yeah, there you go. That's another number. It's next week, right? Wow. Yeah, the age is really impressive on this one. Um, and it's a hu- 11-year-old, 143. Mike, I swear to God, watch that signature. Don't, don't, don't touch the signature. Oh. Don't do it. <laughs> don't love it, but don't do it. Right here, here. I'm gonna hand your glass over. No, I'm gonna, no, no. I'm gonna hand the whiskey I will over. Give it back, and Mike. Back. I, I'm sorry, I had to take that. Don't give me the glass. Give me the glass back. <laughs> I'm no, giving no. him the glass so that he can pour We're it. Fine. Oh, we need a fresh crack at first. You got to crack it. This has yet to. No, you got to crack that. Hold on, hold on. Wait, wait. I was looking at the bottle. Careful with the signature. <laughs> I was gonna throw it in the ground afterwards. I was gonna like. Yeah. No, that is so cool. That is so knife here. So this is something that's really very one of a kind. Ish. Or very rare ish, right? Ooh. Yes. Okay. Yeah. So, how did you come across this again? You said it was the similar to this to one. It was similar to this one. You just kind of raffle. No, raffle. it was a raffle. It was a raffle. It was a raffle. It was a raffle through through Sealbox. 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 Yeah. Sealbox yes. Which is the same company that I got yes. that one through. Yeah. Yes. Yes. And how did you sign up? Is it just like anybody can sign up, or no? It, again, it was through the same program that I or the. Is it like? Yeah, put blood in to the, get the, in this the thing? pro membership you can get with them. Blood in, blood so, out. So, but how, what do you mean, like pro membership? Like you buy a certain amount, and then suddenly they there's a yearly it. a yearly uh, fee, and then you get it, you know special access okay. to special bottles like this. Okay, or at least a chance. To I, I want to smell from the bottle real quick, if you don't mind. Yeah, if you don't mind, I'll be careful. I promise, I'll be careful. Well, let's Steve on, go let first. I learned I learned my lesson. He just cracked it. It's his bottle. He just cracked. But it. Man, I want to smell that. That is so dark. It looks like molasses. Oh boy, he's it, smiling. It, it looks like molasses. He's smiling. Like if you hand, if you put it on the table, you could say that's like oh, it's a like maple syrup. That's so dark. Oh, dude, that's you know it, freaking insane. You know the common denominator is smell the nectar. I think that it's, is it's Georgia. Insane. Oh wow! Because ASW and Thirteenth Colony Ooh. have putting out some really that is crazy. Dark notes like these have. It's unbelievable. All right, here. All right, what did you smell? What did you smell? It's just earthy, but oaky, but wow. Molasses. Molasses, yeah. The dark, that dark, it is Molasses. Literally. That is yeah. so <coughs> All right, freaking all right. good. Pour it. Fudge, molasses, a little so bit of cranberry. That's the unfortunate part, right, is you can't just get this like you can't just join a club and then be able to get this no like it's not one of those i mean it's That's random literally what i did but it's random this one you got you lucky yeah, like this, with everything you do with your one. weird strange you weird whiskey radar you wizard have. of the warlock of, you were actually you're a whiskey warlock doom thank you mike you are a whiskey warlock Wow, you have powers beyond our imagination. <laughs> <laughs> Where, where's the truck? and you build submarines? Hey, have you ever thought about building yeah. a yellow submarine? Damn it, guys! Look at these colors. Damn it! I know. I'm Damn trying. To, I'm working on it, but Takeda's oh, making I me clean, clean I, his glass. I, no, I cleaned my glass already. You did not. I did. I'm working on it right now. I just did. so Steve. Have you ever thought about maybe building a yellow submarine? There's a, <laughs> there's a song. We all live in the yellow submarine. And you know, there's a movie. You use a movie for the design and functionality. You know, I I, I tried to, but Paul McCartney he served me. Ah. Bastard. Got him. <laughs> no, he, well, he's, still, he's still bitter of the whole Michael Jackson thing. Who <laughs> bought all this stuff? <laughs> so like, Ooh. all right, all right, enough, enough good, good silliness. Here we go. Wow. Oh wow, this is gonna be legit. So it's like molasses running through. I'm uh, curious to see close. what notes you guys are getting because I think I'm definitely getting some unique ones. All right, there you go. That I don't know if I've ever gotten before. Wow. Yeah, me too. That's <laughs> that's like I don't even know what the fuck's yeah, I'm not, going I'm on. I'm not sure what's going on in here. There's a sweet, the, sweet, the molasses is there. You tasted it. You went in. What happened? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What happened? Talk to us. That smells like vanilla. Yep. Same thing on the palate that I got on the nose. Ooh. Peach. Yep. There's something sweet. You in guys there. get is that? It peach? that? Peach it's, candies. Okay, so those is that peach, peach candies? Those peach candies. Like is that what this rings? is? Because there's something sweet. It's, it's like, like a lighter fit. stone fruit. It's so like a peach apricot, that kind of thing. More peach for me. Mm. Oh yeah, man, that smells good. I've I mean, it's hot. This is, gotten, okay, this is hotter. I mean, this is my tongue. Wow, that peach comes out in the end really good too. And I've never gotten that from a rye, which is crazy. It went from hot to peach. I'm in love. 
I'm in love. This is so good. Uh, you're not gonna leave that here, are you? <laughs> <laughs> I'll I'll trade you my car. Mode. I love you, buddy, but not that yeah, much. No, I'll that. give you my rental car. You can sell you, it. You take the rental car. <laughs> <laughs> That's a great idea, bro. That, that would is, work. That would work. That is so. That's amazing. Good. And it's 143 proof, 143 point whatever, but 143 proof, right? So it's it's hot, but it's like, like all of those good smells. Mm. The there is like a vanilla, there is a marzipan, there's like all of those I, good flavors yeah. that are sweet are like followed by this heat. I and can't believe this so is yeah. I can't believe this is uh, the proof what good. it is with the flavors I'm getting out of it. Like that was impressive, the first one, but this is a different level. This is just super this rich, is, this and is it's a, a lot more, yeah. it's a I think, complex would be yeah. the word yeah, 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 yeah. than the ASW was. And that's a different level. Well, that one literally just tasted like you were taking a bite of a, a yeah. corn on the cob. Like, that's, like, unbuttered, unsalted, on anything. Like, it was like, oh, you stripped it back, took back a bite. Back to the corn again. That I never back tasted. to the corn. No this more corn. One. We're not allowed to talk about corn no, anymore that, that's tonight. That's what that one talks. That, 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 that one tastes like that. No more corn. This one. This one is sweet. This one is like almond paste. This one is complex. Yeah. Complexed. Complexed. Really, really freaking tasty. Holy crap. Man, this one's crazy. Mm. All right. You, you know, know I haven't I, tried the regular bourbons yeah, and rice, but I've heard right. great things about them you as well. You want this? You want that? There you go. Yeah. That's next. <laughs> <laughs> You know what? I'm the commissioner of the football league. You're only picking kickers. That's all you're allowed to pick. He's our guest. And you can start pickers. Yeah, but you guys are doing your thing. I, 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 like, I, I'm the one who goes in early before everybody else. I'm the one who drinks too much on the show usually, but it's a, for you tonight. <laughs> I did two drops. What about you guys? I'm going to do two. I haven't even started yet. I'm I think just, two, like, I think two is a great, like... <laughs> you just throw it go outside. Get it. Go, get like, it. go get it. Go get it. I'm glad you're here. You surprised. So these guys, these guys tonight, did something really mean to yeah, me. Yeah, let's talk about that. So all day long, I'm working hard all day, sweating. Sweating away. Sweating, yeah. the, sweating with the bricks. All right. In the rain. Yeah. Sweating and it rained on. Day. It was, if it went weather, hot, then it rained hot, and it got hotter. All right. And you know what? It's going to be the same yep. thing tomorrow. All right. Guaranteed. Yep. Guaranteed. Wait, it's been going the last couple of days. Tomorrow's Saturday. So. A lot of, we've got a lot of rain. You know, you've been living here. Mm. Florida. So, um... I, you know, planning to do a show. I think T.I. is where he's living now, which is in that place in North Carolina. Mm-hmm. And, it's, you know, Steve's coming over, and, and we have to do – I have to set up a show. He's telling me I have to pull all this equipment out. I have to do all these things. You know, I'm stressed. I'm stressing out. I was yeah. actually stressing out before you came over about this whole thing, by the way. I'm setting up. You saw how it was, was the board. You saw what I was doing with the board. <laughs> right? I'm bringing in bricks. I'm using bricks, okay? I'm a brick layer, and I'm using bricks for my show to set this thing up. Was I not? Yeah, it was a situation. Where I brought bricks in. Yep. Right? So, then suddenly, 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 my without warning, knocking on my door. I'm like, knock on the door. Because nobody, nobody knocks on the door anymore, right? Nobody, rap, no, rap, nobody rap, just comes rap, over randomly anymore, rap, right? Rap rapping. Who right? knocks on the door without right, texting right? first? <laughs> no, no one gets company anymore. No one just shows up anymore. It's I you, do. Right? Then suddenly, and I see this, like, a head with glasses. I think it's somebody who... I would not have been happy. We if you don't suddenly, care about right. No, no, no. Yeah, we but I was saying no, no names, and I was like, "What are you even doing here?" I was actually getting angry as I was walking through the door, and I was going to explain to him that you can't even come in my house. <laughs> and then you opened the door. And it was him, and it was me. And he's a di- all the while you thought Ti was in North Carolina, yes, about to connect yes. with us. So You're watching Zoom. me, you Steve, watching me suffer yeah. trying to set these things up. It was awesome. <laughs> <laughs> it was not my. I love it. No, love it was it. actually a great surprise. I'm glad, Ti, you're here. We're gonna have a great for the great day for the draft tomorrow. Now it's gonna be even are. better. Now, now we're the actual. Uh, <laughs> the band is back together. The band is back you, together. You were you were the horns, man. You were the <laughs> <laughs> you were the horns, man. For the day. You know. For the day. <laughs> All right, so I put the water in there. I haven't. Tasted yeah, I haven't it tried yet. it yet. It doesn't change it, by the way. Nope. It's still no. spicy as fuck. Yep. This one is giving me fire. It's one of those. Wow, yeah, it really did. Uh, actually, can you pour me a little bit more real quick? Or after you do your water, extra water thing? Oh, oh you just handed the bottle. Mm. There you go. 
I'm going to actually add a few more drops and see if that doesn't Bye. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, Steve. We own his house now. That, that's how it works. It's he, worth he it. leaves, we own the house. You can have the house, the wife, and the kid. All <laughs> yours. <laughs> I'll be happy with... This will keep me drunk for at least five days. <laughs> as strong as it is. So I put two more drops in mine. We'll see what that does. Because, yeah, two the, the initial two yeah, you really didn't, didn't do no. much. No. Holy cow. No, not at all. This thing's a powerhouse. So that's why I want to hear. I, I, hey, actually, I, can you pass me the limestone now? Oh, you're so neat. Oh my god! Honestly, like I one, I love. So I'm gonna, I love the I'm gonna bottle. Go f- I'm gonna go four, but that color is insane. Right. Like that is so. That's so, like it's an insane color. Like it's so deep amber, comparatively to like that one. It's got to be the Georgia heat. It has to be. It has so to be something, dude. Because like, is this from Georgia? That one's 100% corn. This one is not. Right. Same color. Yeah. Well, this one's deeper. It's, it's right, so I, I did and I did four drops this time. So let's see what happens. Because the two did absolutely nothing. Yeah. Let us know. Mm. So what made you pick this one? Out of like, I'm assuming you had other four options. Four changes it. What, what, what made you choose this one? I, I didn't have options. Oh, you didn't? No. They were just like, why would you? We have this, and now uh, you can choose it. <laughs> no, okay. no. I want the George Dickel. <laughs> I want um, the old granddad one guys, fourteen guys four, yeah. Um, okay. The molasses comes out a little bit more. Can you uh, toss it back over this way? Definitely comes back. I careful there, Ti. I toss. Careful, Ti. That's limestone. Limestone. Well, technically it's glass, okay. and then there's limestone. I guess I'll do. Also, what you did two more after the fact. So I've done a total of six now, which I think wow. is what you are at, right? You did two and then four. Yes. Yeah. Oh, yes, yes. Okay. You got to carry the one. Carry the one. Okay. I got to do then, no, four. No, once you I got to you know, do four. That's good. You, 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 you computer kids, you know. <laughs> think so much like that, you know. I'm just an old brick layer now, you know. In my old age, just laying brick. Okay. I'm with you, man. Yeah. Okay. All right. So I just, you're a young, you're a baby. <laughs> I'm with you now as of last <laughs> Thursday. <laughs> you're nothing. You don't know idea. So old. Old and pain. So old. It sucks when you get up in the middle of the night okay, get piss, so and then hurt yourself. It cut, it cut the <laughs> nose down. The nose is no longer offensive. Yeah, it's, it, yeah it, it changes it. The, the six drops is where it's at. It's almost like the, the cherry chocolate on the nose. And the, 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 the molasses is really coming out more to me. The coating on your tongue is different, too. I swear, I feel like it almost made it more viscous now that it has six it's drops dry. dry. It's dry. It's dry. It got dry. It's dry as hell. I'm going with Smice because it's, it's burning. Like, this is dry, dry. I had two. But it, the weird part is, is like, it's not as hot as that one. Um, No, it's hotter. It's dry. There's a difference. Like, it's, it's that last, dry. That last sip down the wrong way. Whew, that was hot. Well, I'm, yeah, I'm, sw- uh, I'm actually sweating in the AC right now. Don't breathe it in. Of course, that's not going to go well for you. <laughs> Tom Brady. That's all I have to say. Tom Brady. Don't breathe it in. It's gonna go bad. Mm. Tom Brady. <laughs> Tom Brady. <laughs> all hell, Tom Brady. All right. So that's what's fun about this is it sounds like we're all having a slightly different experience. Um, I do think it's slightly. You can tell there's slightly more ethanol. Yeah. No. This is this is a bit hard, holy harsher. Crap. No, I like this. I'd this is this so much more full bodied and complex mm-hmm. and just. All around. No, and I would agree. Like, that is corn. A banger. That is corn. This, when you add that sixth drop of, of water, like limestone, the depth of flavor is insane. It becomes almost like a uh, like a dark cherry, and it's very dry. It, yeah, with what, it got dry. Now, I added ice. I would say, in general, I would do it with the drops. The ice yeah. isn't bad. Uh, ice is not bad. It's actually because I'm sweating right now. It's a little refreshing. Um, <laughs> but I would say go with the drops on this one. As I said, the same thing as the last one, too. I think I said the same thing. But it's not bad with the ice. It's really not bad. I have no. two cubes because I'm sweating again. <laughs> no, this is this is a fantastic whiskey. The, um, the, that chocolate cherry thing, that dark yeah. chocolate cherry, is actually more prevalent with the ice, in my opinion. Really? 
if you want, you want, you should try it. I would pour a little bit more so you get a little mix in there. No, no, I don't want that. I just want one one cube. Because that that I try not to use any of that like, cherries coming, which I love cherries. I I love cherries. I ate I a bag a week from Publix this whole summer in a bag a week. Wow. Cherries are really good for uh, Ooh, anti-inflammatory. I can smell that. Uh, Ooh. I mean, it's really has a dark cherry. That cherry is coming out with the ice. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that punch is gone. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Right on the nose. It's crazy. I'm it's almost, I'm almost gonna, I'm almost gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna rechange my statement now. Okay. A new fact check. I think I like it better with ice. Holy moly. That cherry comes out so much with the ice. Wow. Right? Am I wrong? You are not. No. This is this is amazing. On ice, this is amazing. What whiskey t- what whiskey goes from peach to cherry the way this, to did, me, this did? To me, I think those like if you're gonna do anything, you're gonna either enjoy this neat because of the unique flavors that it brings with no no water at all. Oh, I'd make a usual thing. Or this. you're going to add in a single rock, and you're going to enjoy it that way. Because, like, I think if you added in another cube, it would become too watered down. No, I have two. No, I, I'm I have one, and it's perfect. So I'm going to throw some out here, T.I. Do you have one? Yeah. Yeah, okay, whatever, you girls. So listen, because I have two. I'm more of a man. But anyway, T.I. Um, because you have, let, you have T. more? T.I. <laughs> um, remember the, the drink, the usual? Yeah. I think this would be a good drink. <laughs> <laughs> I think uh, this would make a good usual. Yeah. What do you mean by that usual? So, oh, it's, a, never it's had a drink. A usual. No, he has not. Oh. That's a drink? Oh. Not so when this. I first met T.I. Take this, this is away. This Take is this away me... from him because he doesn't need this for the usual. Okay. I think yeah. it would make a great usual. Yeah. Not because. for the price point and, you, and like unusual. Wait, how much was it? It was, uh, it, it was about 200 that's not the usual. No, it's not. No. That's okay, the, but, that's but, the, but, okay, okay, that's but. the unusual. But this was my honestly, <laughs> this was my one opportunity to get a thirteenth colony cast drink. Sure, no, I get it. I, I would. I, it's amazing. I want one. Beautiful. I want one. That I was able to. No, but so the usual is a drink that, w- if it wasn't that much money, I think it'd make a great usual drink. So the usual is a uh, rye, cherry bitters, and a little splash of ginger ale. Tasty cocktail. It's, that's how that's how Ti and myself actually got started drinking whiskey. It is damn delicious. So I'm did you saying, come up with this, or where did this come from? Uh, a friend of mine told me about this yeah. drink years ago. Actually, okay. my buddy Ryan. I'm gonna call him out, Ryan. It's my boy mm-hmm. out there, Ryan. He never listens to my show, but you know, it's okay. I'll, I'll, I forgive him. If you call him out, you might. You never, <laughs> yeah, know. you never know. If you say Ryan three times, he comes out. Ryan, <laughs> Ryan, Ryan. <laughs> like Candy Man, right? <laughs> <laughs> There's a B. <laughs> But this this is such a, it's an insanely dark whiskey, like it is yes. genuinely insanely dark. Like I can see wow, through ice, that man. corn one, this one can't see through it. The flavor, super super deep cherry. When you have ice, like when you cool it down to a super temp, before before then it's kind of uh, it's spicy. I don't I don't know if I pulled anything out other than. It's spicy. Oh, man. Like, yeah. just, on, just, no, like, I, I just like with water, ice. like, when we squirted, like, you had some little water in it. It was just, it was it was a hot like, whiskey. But I would sit outside of my front porch with two cubes and that oh, and yeah. be very happy. If yeah. you're outside, you got to do the ice. Yeah, yeah. Sure. I would be, I'm just saying, like, that, this, like, I don't think I would, like this. the yeah. Fiddler, the ice really didn't work for me. I, 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 I suffered and drank. Well, there. you wouldn't want but to. But this stuff with ice in the heat. And right now, how hot it is, I'm sweating from it directly anyway. Is I like it. And I think that's because this thing had more notes in it. Yes. To oh, unpack you had notes with oh, the yeah. ice. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Well, the, the, the cherry came out, and that was, that was a pleasant surprise. Really? Because we were, we were all like, hyped. The peach, the peach was like, oh my God, peach is there. Peach is there. You know, some might say it was the cherry on top. Uh, <laughs> Ooh, <laughs> up. All right. So, cheap. so I think it's time to move to the third one because we, we are getting close. We are getting close. Okay. And this has been a great adventure on Steve's birthday All right, episode. Steve, I need you to hype this one up the most. I need you to, I need you to go crazy on this one. Hype it. 
I had the Rocky theme. Wait, hold, wait, 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 wait. Can we do Rocky theme? For less than thirty seconds, right? No, no, it's less than ten seconds. Alright, had a stretch. <laughs> wow. Alright, what do we got? Alright, so this baby. Um, Gonna fly now. Backstory. Oh, wow. What the hell? Oh, shit. Wow. I said the wrong word. What is that? Oh, shit. Backstory. Oh, on I this remember guy. this one. I remember this one. You guys do know of this is. This I know this. Oh, we I know, know this. this one. We know this one. I know this. Oh, we know this. Okay, one. So this okay, look, look, look. is through a Boston club that I'm in called Jews and Booze. Jews and Booze. Who I was okay. connected Jews to via somebody th- with in the Palm Beach Bourbon Society. Mm-hmm. Um, Calling out names. You're name dropping right now. Yes, I am. Oh, phone call. No, no. I'm pulling up the data on this so I can talk to you. We got data. <laughs> oh, we got data. Okay. Is it kosher? It is. It's very kosher. It's so Seriously? kosher, it hurts your mom. So this guy... <laughs> is that even... <laughs> what? <laughs> is that even... <laughs> I never heard that <laughs> <laughs> what does that even mean? I don't know. <laughs> no, I told you guys what I used to think kosher meant, right? <laughs> what my dad told me? Yeah. What did you did. tell you? Tell me again. Until I was like 12 years old, my dad told me that kosher meant the rabbi peed on it. And I believed him. <laughs> no. Oh, oh <laughs> dear Lord. <laughs> I told him something. Wow. Mom. I wow. made a mom, your mom joke. In. Yeah, don't worry about it. Just All right, keep going. Folks, moving on from that. Keep going. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm sorry. All right, people. The people are confused. No, right. They're not. Let's move on. <laughs> wow. So this is a single barrel <laughs> Canadian whiskey. Uh, uh-huh. Uh-huh. It's from the Black Velvet Canadian Whiskey Black Velvet. Uh, Distillery, who was acquired by Heaven Hill. At the end of 2019. Okay, okay. which I like the product. So, re- okay. recent acquisition. Okay. At the time, uh, they were, I believe, the second. They're currently now the third largest selling Canadian whiskey in the world. Dang. Uh, behind Crown and uh, Canadian Club. Crown is, is actually amazing sales, by the way. Oh, yeah, yeah. They're number one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, so, this guy, let's, go to, let's get in the numbers. The numbers. 22 years, nine 22 months. Years. 22 years, two months. Okay. So this what? is what I meant earlier when I said she's old enough to drink. What did you say? 22 years. Nine <laughs> 22 years. 22 years. Nine, nine months. Yeah. Hey, oh, hey, oh, hey. It's a Fugazi. It's a fugazi. <laughs> oh, it's a total Fugazi. <laughs> Continue. <laughs> no, I caught up to him. It's dangerous now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm screwed. Oh yeah. Wait till where we go next. Okay. So, <laughs> 22 years, nine months, 97 percent corn. So kind of close to this that, guy. Yeah. Uh, There's your corn in the cob. Two point yeah. Two point seven percent rye and only 0.3 percent malted barley. Which oh is well, we don't even know it's there. Pretty unique. It's basically not there. Yeah. Ba- basically not there. Um, and then you know. Last but not least, what's our proof? 171.2 proof. What? So we've got a 22 proof. year and nine month old Canadian whiskey proof. that's 171.2 proof. Frank, and and what's sorry. the alcohol? What's the actual alcohol on that? It, that's 85.6. Yeah, <laughs> it's insane. It's a very large number. Holy right. shit. Okay, we're only driving the golf cart wherever we go. So, tonight. guys, we've got our ice cubes, <laughs> uh, we've wherever got we our going. limestone water, and. Oh. Soaking clean. Let's see. Wait, rinse your mouth right, out. We this can is, make this rinse your mouth you. out. You Maybe you like it straight, straight up as it is. Who knows? Don't discount that. I'm more about around the world, but it's okay. We'll see how it happens. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, I already cleaned my glass out. Stop it's cleaning my extra bit. glass. It's the last bit. <sighs> so, um, I'm going to talk about work for a second. So, I've oh been boy. doing a job. In a exclusive area of Jupiter called the Bear Club. The Bear Club? The Bear Club. Okay, so the Bear Club has certain types of people that live there. Yeah. 
so I, I can say this because everyone knows he, he does live there. Two blocks away from where I'm living, Mr. Jordan lives Wolf. in the neighborhood. Michael Jordan. Yep. I drive by Rory's house every day. Okay. I want his house. And apparently the guy is big into either tennis or pickleball. Oh, yeah. yeah. Pickleball. Man, it's everywhere. Yeah. But it, it's it's just like, it, it's just kind of cool. Dude, the bottle actually says juice. It's just, I, uh, I have to. I, it does. It I says juice and booze. I, I, I need a picture. Oh, you took it away from me. That's, Hopefully that's you can. That's a good it. reason. So that is okay. the name of the club. Huge Juice. shout out to Jews and Booze and uh, Jews and Booze. Are, are they based out of New York? They're Boston. Hell yeah! Wow. Yeah. I need some. Big shout out to Jews and Booze I, I and Josh in Boston. In Boston. My hat. Boston. Okay. There you go. Take all the pictures you want, weirdo. No, there's a reason why I'm doing that. <laughs> I'm going to tell all my New York friends that I'm all, I'm all shit on this. I forgot how strong this was. So we've had this before? I've had this before? You yeah, have. We have. Where? We have. At when? Episode 46? <laughs> the numbers on this. No, was it episode 44, 46? How it was do you, one of those ones. How do you I, enjoy, lo- I love that you're even in the ballpark. So wait, wait. Is the ball says, please enjoy responsibly. How do you enjoy 172? It's the one where we did. It's, it's the one where we did there's, the, there's a, one. the Maker's Mark episode. And we did a bunch yes, of different ones. that was it. I think it was like episode like 44. Okay. Um, And then after the episode, what you guys don't know is Steve has... The most beautiful collection of whiskey, and this is one of them. Oh, and then he we, does; it's very pretty. And then you would have seen it behind us, but this is one of the ones that we were actually able to try, and he was very um, open to us just being able to try whatever whiskeys we wanted. And this was one of them because, I mean, mainly it's just an interesting name, uh, but also it was the highest proof that we've ever seen. But that was just a manufactured whiskey. Do you remember the butt? I don't. The butt is I didn't tell you guys what the proof was. Right. And no, you no, did no, not yeah. think, you thought it was closer to 140 ish. Yeah. That's true. Which is, of course, what we just drank here. And even smelling it, you don't. There's like peppery, like pepperoni type. It's like that kind of, it's like a, it's like a, it, I don't want to say pepperoni. It's, it's a, you can tell there's a, you can tell there's like a seasoning behind it. Like there's, it's hot, but it's hot because there's like, you know, it's like cumin in taco meat. It's pepperoni in a pizza. It's, it's that kind of stuff. Like. It's definitely one you want to keep your mouth open. It's one, nose yeah. It, it's, it's not hot because it's just hot. There's, it's hot because there is blah. What that blah is, I can't. I was. I had. I had to send text out this like, one. You know what I'm saying. This had right? to be sent out. I'm sorry. I, I. I don't remember this. I don't remember trying this at your house. That I, sucks for you. Because if I did this at your house, I would take the same pictures and do the same thing I just did right now. I know I didn't do that. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what I mean by that, right? When I say like it's hot because well, like, it's like so mellow on the nose. I did connect with. So uh, wait, like wait. Kind of those pizza toppings. I get yeah. that. Yeah, it's interesting. It, it's the lightest color of the three. And it's the highest proof. Yeah, it, well, and the age, not just the and, and, and it's the oldest age. Cow. You know what? Actually, think about the guys, real quick, real quick. My chicken cock. I'm thinking about uh, it. Uh, my not my, cock, my chicken though. cock. Not your cock. No, 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 I'm no. My 20 year old cotton cog cock, very light in color, but 20 years old, right? Okay. This is what 20 something years old, 171 proof, but yet light in color from Canadian. <laughs> it's just. Very interesting, man. Yeah, just a straight up white Jew cock versus a uh, straight up Canadian white cock. It's just, I uh, did not say that. You no, know. you are bad. <laughs> oh my god! It's a wide world, folks. It's a wide, wide world. Travis is taking it wider than most right now. You're the one that brought it up. I did not say. I'm not saying that word you said. <laughs> I'm not Literally saying that. You said it. It's horrible. <laughs> But I can't get over how light this smells. <laughs> yeah. It's, it's not, the last two were like burning my Same. nose. There's no burning going on here. Because it's, you know, it's not strong. Wow. 
Did you get it? You get Ooh. a burn? Yep. Okay. It's an angry Jew. <laughs> Uh, so this one is non-chill filtered. But it goes like away, very, but it goes away very quick, though. It goes away that so quick. That one's non-chill filtered, right? The second one we had? They're all, I believe, yeah. Okay. Which actually does make a difference because that adds the the creaminess to it because all the fats that are within the wood and everything else ends up staying in the whiskey. And Wait, not being you know, this is not out. kosher, by the way. How do you know? It has to say kosher on it. It actually. So I, I used to own a restaurant and bakery. We had a we, during the Jewish holidays. We actually had a rabbi in our bakery isn't to certify star, our isn't food. The star kosher. David enough? No, no, it's not. Star David is not kosher. Oh. I don't know. <laughs> it seems like enough. <sighs> no, but this is not kosher. It's, tw- it's twice. It literally has the same symbol. It's twice. fine. But it's so you kosher. had a rabbi come in and actually, yeah, do the thing. Yeah. Wow. Oh, yeah. Oh, and watched the entire time. He was there the entire, Three whatever it, the length of where you'd buy the our goods during the holidays, which were you know many Jewish holidays. You know your Jewish holidays. We had a rabbi there to certify our stuff. Our distilled in Alberta, the twenty-two nine year. We had the only rugula in town that was actually certified kosher. Twenty-two wow, year old awesome. whiskey. Twenty-two yes. year old whiskey. And our cannolis were kosher too. <laughs> It was awesome. <laughs> yeah, it literally doesn't have anything about it being kosher. It's just it has to say the word kosher. Bottled by First Cut Barrel Co. That's so that's you know I mentioned anything. Josh. That's his company. Okay. I'm sorry. Since you've already had this, I don't remember any of this. I'm going in first with the worms. Here, Ti, can you pass it over? I'm just gonna pop this guy in here. Pop her in there. There we go. There we go. I'm having a good time tonight. Like that's that's impressive. It's a good age, huh? I think this. Is I love anything in the twenties. I do, I honestly do any kind of wh- like. I have a few now in the twenties. I love that age for whiskey. So how much and scotch too? I love the scotch. How the, much was this for you? <sighs> honestly, I don't remember. Like, did you find it at some place for like ten dollars? Like no, you this normally is do. A club. No, this, this is, is a through club. the club. I thought yeah. the club thing. Yeah. You and your clubs. That's how you get the good stuff. Yeah. This I'm is just pick. saying. This is a pick. So if you if you're gonna try to take a guess at what it was, I would say north of a hundred. Okay, right. but, but how probably north? not much more than 150. Okay, okay. so was Which that one? Wait, 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 wait. I, I forgot. Was that good. more? The uh, last one we just did. Th- this was yes. How much was that one again? This was around two. And it was signed by somebody. By so the master distiller. Yeah. Okay, so so Which it's it's cool. probably mm-hmm. if it wasn't signed, it would probably be in this price range then. Uh, right? No. We'll, 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 we'll be serious about this. Uh, it's signed, so it, it's going to be elevated. Yeah, see, for me, for me, like sign doesn't mean much. It what does. it is is the quality of whiskey that you're doesn't getting. matter. It doesn't matter if 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 someone That's famous a made a fucking whiskey, whiskey and I mean a curse and they signed it, it they sell for two hundred dollars. <laughs> Tiger Woods made a whiskey and he signed it. It, was, it would sell for three hundred dollars. And it's on. We have the debate. He he could take high ten. Put it in another bottle, put his face on it, <laughs> and sign it, and you can sell it for $500. I am right. You were wrong. <laughs> Me? All right. Well, I guess no, I'll not your face. Some, no. I'm going to start signing some No, high your face 10. would be like negative five. I'm going to start signing some high 10, and here we go, ladies and gents. I'm going to sell it off. Once again, now, for 171 proof, you said? Yeah, 171.2. This is not killing me right? by any means. I put two drops of water You're in. at two. Okay, what about you? None. Yeah, with water. None. Uh, I need to do some draws. I haven't done that yet. Um, I don't think it. T- I don't think it changed it much. No, a little. Sp- okay, okay. Wait, no, wait. The heat is not as bad now. The heat. The the heat. Uh, <laughs> wrong wrong words. So I actually like the heat. The heat changed. All right. How many? How many do you have? Two. All right. So I just did four. You have two. You did four. Of the proof he is point. four. I did two. Honestly, you should have done two in my opinion to try it out first. What? Try mine. Oh, no, I think it's a good thing that we did a different amount, right? I we guess I'll do notes. six. Do ten. See how it goes. Right. So you're happy at two. That's interesting. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Where I wasn't happy at two with that one. Right, yeah. Yeah. No, I'm actually happy at two. Okay. In fact, I'm not even, I'm not even thinking about ice right now because I don't, don't think I need it. I will say it's six. Like, all and the, I have heartburn. All that weird, all that ethanol bite. Gone. Gone. Yeah. 
at six. Uh, ooh. I'm gonna drop it. I'm gonna drop two more. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit four right now. I'm not gonna catch up to you at six yet because I still have a little Dang. ethanol. The ethanol still like there. That. I like that. That's pretty nice. That's pretty nice. But we also had this one after the uh, the onslaught of the Maker's Mark, and I can say like as the third bottle now, it's a lot hotter. Than I remember it being, but I think with I think with the water, like there's a lot more depth of flavor. I I mean comparatively to what I was drinking before, like it's a lot more I don't know, like dark fruits, that kind of thing. Like, like there's a lot more of that going on. Than before, where it was nope. just like it was just more. Hot. The heat came back with four. Really? really? Yes. That's weird. The two was better because he was enjoying it four. I liked it with two. I have six right now, and I'm thinking. I'm. Dark a, I'm sorry. I went. I, I'm so sorry. I just. I just went to four. I really. So you am. did two more, or you did four? Additions? I know. I, I added two more. Two more. Okay. And I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, now I have to add two more now because I don't like what I just. I just did. We have acoustical instruments here. Amateur hour. <laughs> no, I can't make him do it again. Yes, you can. We do a whole song. We do a little Led Zeppelin. Well, like, I'm telling you, like, the four brought back so mm. much heat. Which is odd, because the more water you think we would. Either way, I think what we can determine from this is water has an impact and the impact is felt differently. I'm sweating. Based off of the individual's preference. That's crazy. And, you know, it's not just water. Because it's water and temperature. Because yeah. the ice. My God, what that did to this 13th colony was fantastic. Yes. Mm-hmm. Anyways. The six now brings it back down. So. No, the six. Because br- well, no, your it. six is mellow, right? My six is mellow. It's mellow again. Yeah. That is crazy. And that's what I've never seen. I've never seen a whiskey go from it's out its own heat to where I was happy with two, where the heat went down. Four, the heat came right back. I had to drink some water. It was that's how bad it was for me right now. Mm -hmm. To six, to went back to where I don't need to drink water again. And you know, it kind of makes sense because at this age, it's going to have that much more tannins in it. So there's going to be that much more to unpack and open up with ice and water. Wow, I'm going for the ice too. Pass me the ice too. Anyways, extra little swiggy. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we hope you've enjoyed Steve's birthday. He's brought some insane picks. Um, Personally, 13th Colony is probably my favorite from like a flavor to... Experience, experience wise. Yeah, it's just the other one, the that very first one, what uh, that's Fiddler, Which I still like that. I like that too. It literally tastes like taking a bite out of a corn on the cob. Um, and then we have this one right here, which is Jews and Booze Single Barrel Canadian Whiskey, which is a limited release. Um, I doubt you'll be able to find this one ever. Yeah. Uh, I think two of them you're not going to find. At 22 years age, nine months, and 171 proof. Uh, delicious. If you are one of the people out there in the world that has it, Hey, more power to you. Try it with six drops of that limestone water from uh, Kentucky. Or any water probably do. I mean, yeah. limestone. I, I went I with this, lime, I went this like, but kind of this limestone. We appreciate you being here. We hope you wish uh, Steve a happy birthday as we go through this nonsense and all the shenanigans. Uh, make sure you check out wow. friskywhiskey.com. Make sure you head over to our Instagram. Boop. Uh, <laughs> we're gonna, we're gonna have a long talk tomorrow. <laughs> we're gonna have a definitely long talk production talk tomorrow. No, there's no production. Talk. Oh no, I'm calling oh, no, the no, meeting. No. <laughs> I'm calling the meeting. So wait, You're real like quick. All my face. So real so quick, I, like, I, wait, wait, wait. I put ice in it. I don't yeah. like it now. Okay, well, I'm telling you, Mike D two just doesn't like six. anything with coldness. Shut up in your freaking corn. <laughs> Cornhole hates his his cold corns. All right, this is a fun night, Steve. Anyways, happy birthday! Happy Thank birthday, you. Steve. Guys, check out 
Fox Cigars. Get your cigars from there. And the Frisky and Whiskey. And Frisky Whiskey. Check out our website. Get some yeah. get some merch. And if you need pavers, go to your good friends at Tico's Pavers in Stewart, Florida. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Come on. That was awesome. <laughs> <laughs> that was the worst run-up ever. I was working on it, and you just ruined it. That was awesome. Anyways, right, have a good tonight. late. What? Go. Have a good... No, I, I can't even. Oh, God. Just Everyone have do a good your night. thing. He can't do your thing. Wow, Goodbye. Get where's out of my face. Hey, folks. Oh. See you later. Wow. Thanks Deuces. For Deuces. Have fun. Bye. <laughs>